All right. Without any further ado, let's go ahead. Once again, Radio Graffiti. Uh, all you have to do to participate in Radio Graffiti is give me a call right now at 775 799 nine one eight zero and once you do you will be a part of radio graffiti all right when i call on your name you've got exactly three to four seconds to say or excuse me four to five seconds to say whatever it is it's on your mind that's why we call this radio graffiti so let's go ahead and let's uh let's go ahead and get this uh going here all right let's go ahead and get this going let's go ahead uh hold on just a second Let's join this meeting here. Welcome, and thank you for choosing right. FreeConferenceCall.com. You're helping people around the world communicate for free. You are the only participant in the conference. All right, well, we're, we're, we're on, okay? So, uh, once again, uh, that's the that should be the number. Is anybody calling in? Oh, shit. I, I have the wrong one. Hold on. I... I I'm in the wrong, I'm in the wrong fucking account. Hold on just a second. I'm in the wrong account. My bad. Here, let me leave the meeting. Sorry about that. Goodbye. I'm in the wrong, I'm in the wrong fucking meeting. Sorry about that. I'm sorry. Wrong one, wrong one, okay? Let me go ahead and, and log out. Sorry. So I'm not Boomer versus Tech, asshole, all right? Shut the fuck up. Jesus Christ, you guys make me fucking want to puke, dude. Jesus fucking Christ. Hold on a sec. Come on. All right, here we go. Sorry about that, folks. I mean, we got to, you know, I got, I got all this shit I got to do here just to bypass shit. Shut up about the boomer mo moment or all that bullshit, or I'm, I'm, I'm going to just continue on with the goddamn, uh, I'm going to continue on with the goddamn uh, videos Welcome and, and shit. thank you All for right? choosing FreeConferenceCall.com. You're helping people around the world communicate for free. There are 18 participants in the conference. All, All right, shut up. Needed. Shut your stupid stinking salmon smelling hole. All right. All right. Now that we're here, once again, call 775-799-9180. And let me go ahead and uh, let me go ahead and get some more scotch, all right? Before we uh, get to radio graffiti, all right? And I'm not stalling, all right? Oh, Jesus Christ, dude! All right, I'm not stalling here, okay? So anyway, cheers to everybody out there, all right? I, I want to say uh, thank you for tuning in with me. Tuesday show, we're trying, we're you know, it's already five and a half hours. So cheers to you guys. Give me a drink. Uh, all right. Uh, do we got some pretty good amount of radio graffiti callers there, engineer? <laughs> Without any further ado, let's go ahead and get to radio graffiti right now. All right. What do we have here? We got a concerned fans. A concerned fan. A co are you fucking a concerned fan? Really, asshole? Anyway, a concerned fan. Uh, radio graffiti. This Cheney Adam Kinzinger establishment cocksucker chills motherfucking back here again. Get the fuck out of here right the fuck right now. Get him the fuck out of here right now. I'm tired of whoever the fuck this idiot that uses fucking chills and shit. Fuck you. Get the fuck out of here right the fuck right now, you fucking piece of shit. Trying to call me an Adam Kissinger fucking Republican fucking... Fuck you. Fuck you, you piece of crap. Jesus Christ. How about Betray the Rage, Radio <laughs> Graffiti? Buy that for a dollar. Hi, this Cheney Adam Kinzinger establishment cocksucker chills motherfucking back here again, back at a ratio, and ghost in his recent agenda of selling out its listeners and interests for the loser, right? I will continue to come on and hold Ghost accountable until he stops this shit. As you all heard tonight with Ghost basically confirming that he skipped shows because he's been talking to the feds and the goal of getting Trump indicted as the globalist he is. He talks shit about the Trump adores candidates and dooming the midterms because of establishments getting primary. All I've 
have two says cope and see every candidate that was endorsed will accept the drive as endorsements. I don't know what Trump was thinking on that one, but anyways, every candidate endorsed will make the Republican Party better and not worse. Uh, Once again, you know what? Shut I up. Just shut the fuck up. Bullshit. Look, oh, shut up. Somebody shut this guy up. up. Somebody Jesus shut him up. Out. Shut up. Jesus fucking Christ. This guy's gonna sit over here and try to give me a lecture on goddamn politics, you dumb piece of crap. I've been in this political game a long time. Don't you dare try to tell me how fucking politics works, all right? And by the way, Liz Cheney got dethroned in the primary, okay? So, I I mean, I, I'm not a big uh, Cheney fan, but, uh, you, know, uh, you know, she spearheaded, you know, the right wing or the never-Trump right wing towards the situation that we're in. So, it is what it is. Uh, let me take some numbers here. Oh, yeah, I've got to take some numbers here. How about uh, 720 Radio fucking Graffiti? L. Nick Edwards MMO Radio Graffiti. Oh, yeah. I want me some of that. What's that, Ghosty? You want to be pounded by my extra hard and sexy food of cock? Yes! Yes! Yes, I freaking love having you get shut her massive dude off my ass. If you say so. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, baby. I'm the best. Cox. Look, I don't know why y'all are in this kick of fucking saying shit like that. That's not fucking cool, man. All right? That's not fucking cool. Stupid fucking assholes. That fucking guy owns this place. You're going to get me fucking banned like a bunch of fucking stupid SJW jerk-offs that you are. You son of a bitch. Here, give me another fucking drink of scotch here. I'm not fucking drunk enough to be able to fucking find this amusing at all. Uh, all right, where are we at here? All right, I gotta, I gotta take another one here. How about uh, seven oh seven radio graffiti? Oh wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. What the hell happened? Seven oh seven radio graffiti. Get him out of here. W. Shut up. Fucking W, you fucking idiot. Jesus Christ. All right, let's continue. How about, uh, who the hell is Ron the Cokehead, Radio Graffiti? You see, Dad, it's not just superficial. I'm deep in love. What the fuck does that mean? You know how when I go in the bulkhead of Cheesy Charlie's and I sink all the way down to the bottom and you can't find me? Bowling on your swords for Trump. I'm talking about positive. I'm talking about Paul I'm talking about Paul Deep. 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 I'm talking about Look, assholes, I'm gonna fucking end Radio Graffiti if y'all are gonna get fucking pedophilic. What the fuck? Shut this asshole up! Shut him up! Jesus Christ, dude. Dude, I'm not liking what we're... I, I don't like what we're doing here, all right? I mean, this is already a fucking bad Radio Graffiti time, all right? This is already getting bad. Give me a drink. Dude, fuck off with this boomer moment shit. Dude, y'all are pissing me off. Dude, y'all pissed me off all day today, all right? You guys are lucky I even showed up today, and this is how you fucking guys are coming at me, dude. Give me a fucking break. How about that shit? How about giving me a fucking break, man? Jesus Christ, man. Uh, all right, let's continue. Who we got here? How about, uh, let's take a, a couple of other numbers here. How about uh, area code uh, 470, Radio Graffiti? Mm. Hey, 
had sex with Nick Winters. Ghost has had. Shut the fuck up. This fuck. Fuck whoever that fucker is. All right, whoever the fuck is the scuff Yoda. Dude, I hope that you get an inoperable tumor in your fucking colon and you can't shit and your insides bust and you fucking die a fucking dysentery, you fucking sick fuck. <sighs> sorry, I I'm sorry y'all had to hear that. Here, let me have a fucking drink here. Uh, all right, how about uh, Country Code 61, Radio Graffiti? Hey, guys, this is Drunk Ozzy again. All right, what, what, what do you want? Uh, I'm just listening to your show. You seem to have a bit of trouble dealing with technology. I don't have a tr I don't have trouble dealing with anything, for Christ's sake. It sounds like you're cleaning out your closet. Uh, what are you cleaning it out for there? Huh? You got a couple of, you know, 12-year-old kids in there? What are you doing? No, no, no. I don't smoke inside. Oh, you don't smoke inside? Do you, do you, what, are you a renter? Are you one of those people you rent? You know, you don't want to fucking smoke inside because the landlord will kick your ass out and your fucking platypus up the ass having moose humping piece of shit face? No, you gotta look after stuff when you buy it, mate. Yeah, you gotta look after stuff. You can't just trash it around I smoke wherever the fuck I want to smoke, okay? You want to know why? Because I fucking pay for it, all right? Nobody fucking tells me what to do. I'm not going to fucking go outside like some fucking jerk off, like I'm like I'm some chastised second class citizen to do what I'm doing. All right? The fuck? Well, maybe you should look after your stuff. Get this guy out of here. Get him out of here. All right, go bang a dead kangaroo, you fucking koala up the ass having shithead. <sighs> Sorry, y'all had to hear that. Let's go ahead. How about uh, who the hell is this? Ghost Shekelstein, Radio Graffiti. Uh, Ghost Shekelstein, did you fucking hang up? He fucking hung up. Look at this fucking idiot hung up, for Christ's sake. Uh, how about, uh, who the hell is this? DeSantis 2024, Radio Graffiti. Uh, d what the hell? How come, how come they're fucking hanging up? Stop hanging up! Uh, let's see. How about, uh, Country Code 45, Radio Graffiti. Hello? What's going on? Uh, can you hear me? Hey, is that Bjorn? What's going on to Bjorn? How you been, dude? Uh, I, I've been in jail for 50 days. Yeah, I know you've been in jail. Uh, you told us that you were going to do a stint because you, while you were drunk, of course, and facetiously saying, said some things about the prime minister, and you had to do some time for it. So uh, why don't you tell us what it was like in there, man? Yeah, so uh, they they told me to come uh, to the prison. So um, so I, I showed up. There are many people they they don't show up. Uh, they they want to uh, be picked up by the police. Uh, but I I, I came uh, voluntarily to the prison. So they treat me good. Uh, the the first week they 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 put me in a prison cell. There were some problems. Uh, I was in the war a part of the prison, so I stayed there for four days. And uh, we had to make our own food uh, in the prison kitchen. And, uh, uh, but, but I didn't get enough food, so I was starving, actually. So, oh, man, so they just but, give you, like, bare minimum food, and you know, there's no seconds, there's yeah. not a big portion or anything? Yeah, they, they give me, uh, like, uh, something uh, pre-made uh, uh, prison food. Oh, jeez, that sounds like crap, dude. Uh, was there any, like, uh, buddy trying to, you know, get a little homosexual with you in there? No, there were, there were no and there were no gay people, so. Well, you didn't have to say that there was no N-words in there. I think that we could, I mean, how, how many, uh, how many black folks are out there in Denmark anyway? That's like, uh, uh, under under one percent. Under one. There are not many. I, I don't know why they, they don't like Denmark. I guess. Do you think it's because don't they don't like the cold and you know traditionally uh, most folks that are of urban demographic they, they like, like a hotter, like a more warmer climate? Yeah, yeah. I think it's something like that, and and they prefer to to stay in France and England. Unreal, it, it's, dude. It's, it's, 
Yeah, so, hey, hey Bjorn, I know everybody wants yeah. to know. Everybody is probably asking, you know, is there any way that you can make it to America? Uh, the, the, the only way is if I uh, buy an airplane ticket to Mexico, and then uh, I can uh, travel uh, over the border uh, very close to where you live in Texas there, and, and I, I can go into Mexico like... Uh, USA that way. Really? They're just going to let you way. across the border? They, you know, they're just going to go ahead and just, you know, okay, go ahead. You look, you look okay. Just go ahead. That's what we're. That's how easy it is to get in here. Uh, yes. Uh, last time, uh, last time I did it, I was, um, I was driving with uh, Blade and Kev TV, and I was, I was just sitting in the back of the car, and I, I, I just gave them uh, my passport. And and they they, they 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 just look at my passport and they and then they let me in. They they they, they not check uh, if I have a criminal record. It's only in the airplane airport that they will check uh, if I have a criminal record. Dude, that's I, un that's I, I unbelievable. Believe, that's unbelievable. But believe, that does sound like a I plan. Do, do you are you coordinating with anybody like Casey or Blade or anybody like that? Um, I, I have other things uh, to do uh, at the moment, so I don't have energy uh, and time uh, to to worry about that now. Um, I understand. I understand. I, How was it? I know you're a big, as big, if not bigger, drinker than I am. How was it like trying to detox from alcohol, being forced into a prison situation? Did you have any trouble? Uh, uh, no, I didn't have any problems at all with that. No, no. Really? Are you serious? Like you didn't have any like panic attacks or like there was nothing you know going wrong with you? You just kind of were able to go to cold turkey and that's it. Yeah, I, I didn't drink so much uh, before because I knew it, it would be a problem if, if I had these kind of uh, problems. So I, I did. I make sure I, I didn't drink so much before. Well, that was very smart. That was pretty good. Uh, so, all in all, all in all, uh, we had to work. what's that? We had to work in the prison. They, they put me to work in the fields. Man, no, that's, that's horrible. We, we, had, we had 120 cows in the prison. 120 cows? Yes, so all the prisoners, they were milking the cows. And uh, we had to make sure that the cows uh, were on the field outside. So they let me outside, uh, and so I cut the grass uh, under the electric fence. That was my job. Wow, man. So all in all, do you think that you should have gone to prison and had this amount of life taken from you by the state? Or do you think that, you know no. what, I was kind of bad, I, I did my time, and we're going to move on? It, it, it was all a big mistake. Uh, it was because I, I, I was live streaming on YouTube, and I, I made a, a joke. And uh, I think uh, that the police has told the Prime Minister of Denmark what I have been saying about her. So I think it was her, personally, that got me in prison. It's a, it's a, it's terrible. Well, that's horrible. But uh, I mean, you, you've got to, you got to feel at least a little bit of some kind of, uh, I don't know, some kind of notoriety, considering that you've got the prime minister of Denmark focusing on you because of what you said about her. You know what I mean? And by the way, women leaders, huh? Women leaders. Yeah. Uh, uh, women uh, leaders in Europe is uh, making. Uh, uh, Europe uh, go to uh, World War Three. It's just terrible. They should stay home and don't go to work. Let the men work. I agree, Bjorn. I've been trying to suggest that, and of course, all these women are like, "Oh my God, Ghost, you're a fucking snake. You're a lizard. You're a misogynist, and all this other crap." I think that women yeah. would be perfectly fine and happy if they would just shut their yap get in the kitchen, get acquainted with some damn kitchen appliances, and not try to become corporate moguls and, you know, try to think they can do everything men can do. Society was better that way, and ever since we allowed these women to become leaders, just like you suggested, these bitches are marching us yeah. into World War III. 
Stay out, stay out of, of, of politics. That's that's for sure. They they are very bad. Yeah, stay the fuck out of politics is right, man. I can agree with that. So, uh, actually, Abior, actually, I, I had some, what's up? I had some questions for you, actually. All right, what's up, dude? Uh, so, first of all, uh, buy me a coffee. Uh, why do you put that? Why why you use that link? Uh, because uh, donation alerts uh, has taken off the PayPal option, and at the same time, uh, you know, it's 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 gotten us a little bit better interaction, uh, you know, that sort of thing. You know, it's it, it's it's not a bad service. Yeah. So your PayPal got banned? No, my PayPal did not get banned. No. Oh, okay. So, uh, have you been to uh, Vietnam? Uh, never, uh, never been to Vietnam. Well, <laughs> I, I can't confirm or deny that I've been to Vietnam. Let's just put it that way. And and you are sixty five years old. Is that true? I can't confirm or deny how old I am. Oh, okay. Do you play Diablo Immortal? Do I play Diablo? What? Immortal? No, I don't. I don't play video games, dude. I, what's I, your I don't point play video of view? Games. What's your point? Last question. What's your point of view on IP2 network? Uh, dude, IP2 has always been uh, cool with me, man. They've always thrown me in the uh, in the network. Uh, I think that uh, IP2, in my opinion, is uh, probably the modern day 4chan. I think 4chan's still relevant, don't get me wrong, but, uh, you know, the kind of things that 4chan used to do back when they were trolling me back in 08, 09, uh, 2010, uh, that's what IP2's doing. What I really don't like, though, is that the direction that IRL is going, and the direction that IRL yeah. is going is just, it's just horrible, dude, you know? Yeah. Like, yeah. you know, we're seeing people smoke uh, methamphetamine, we're seeing them do weird drugs. Yeah. Uh, those two sluts, yeah. uh, Vegan Patriot and Manette, banged all those guys in that, uh, they, they ran a train on them in that fucking RV with Chicken and JJ and Jacob and, and LD. And uh, I mean, that, that's just, that's just unbelievably disgusting de degeneracy. I mean, it's one yeah, thing it's to, to kind of like, Hey, we're drinking, we're having a good time, you know, making content. The, the idea of being a complete and utter degenerate and trying to pass that off as content is just something that I, I can't stand about uh, modern-day IRL, dude. I can't stand that that's what uh, IP2... Well, not all IP2. There's a lot of people on IP2 that are, that are like, fuck this. But a lot of the people are supporting this shit. They're supporting the degeneracy. They're supporting, you know, methamphetamine smokers. They're, 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 uh, you know, promoting a bunch of fucking whore bags uh, that have no business even showing their face. Like fucking vegan patriot for Christ's sake. I mean, what the hell is that? I mean, I know she's glory hole Andy, but just imagine being serviced in a glory hole with that snaggle tooth. You know, you got Manette, who, you know, has the arms the size of Andre the Giant's thighs and, uh, you know, literally gives it up to anybody who gives her attention. And then after she gives it up, she wants you to, like, fucking, you know, pretend that you're married and shit. Uh, and then you got uh, Chicken Andy, which, you know, with all due respect, he's a fucking degenerate piece of fucking low-grade disposable road trash. I mean, this guy went down on a 45-year-old woman that he met you know, uh, at a bar somewhere in public, you know, uh, you got, uh, you know, Jacob, I got a, you know, 14, you got fucking JJ playing that stupid, ridiculous fucking character of his, yeah, dude, you know what I'm saying, dude, I'm fucking sitting over here, dude, I just fucking, you know, fucking, you know, fucking dude, you know, I mean, give me a fucking break, dude, this is, this is not, IRL, and I hate to say this, but Blade and him sitting around and you know drinking with uh, with Becky and yeah. you know so I, I I just think that's horrible, dude. I, I understand that he's got to fake the shots. He's got diabetes, and you know it's, you know it's, it, he's probably in a bad situation. But you know, do something else. I, I don't I don't know what I don't know what else to say. He just exploited him and his mom yesterday. I don't know if you know that uh, he brought his mom yeah, on board. I see and dude, people were just yeah, you know, you know, blade your son is a piece of shit, yeah. and and dude, that's not content, dude. I just uh, 
I, just, I, I don't know what to say about IP2. I used to love going to the network and viewing people like you and, you know, folks that actually were out there doing some shit, providing clippage, and, you know, that, that shit ain't around anymore, man. It's sad. Ice Poseidon? Ice Poseidon? Well, Ice Poseidon turned yeah. into a fucking, a, a fucking weirdo, unfortunately, man. I mean, uh, truth yeah. be told, scuffed Steve Jobs was the brains behind uh, Ice Poseidon. And then once him and yeah, yeah. Uh, you know Scuff Steve Jobs separated, that was the downfall of Ice and his content. Uh, and that's Sam a fact. Sam Pepper. Sam Pepper. Well, Sam Pepper is a fucking con artist. I mean, are you kidding me? He's conned his way into the FaZe Clan. He's conned his way into uh, yanking and yoinking uh, people in the cryptocurrency market. I think he got away with, I think, $3.54 million dollars from that save a kid coin or whatever the fuck it was and the guys i don't know wherever the fuck he's living living you know uh, comfortably i mean this guy ultimate con artist why because he has that brit bong accent you know hey you know here i am on sand pepper you know and look at me i'm able to fucking corn anybody out of any kind of mooching you know i'm a leech you know shit like that you know yeah, well, uh, uh, thank you for talking to me. That was uh, very nice to hear uh, from you. Hey, no very problem, nice. Bjorn. Uh, hey, where can we go uh, find you? Is it uh, the Bjorn TV4 on YouTube? Yes, it is. Yes. I, I just been to uh, another part of Denmark, and I have been filming uh, German bongos. So if you are interested in German uh, military uh, war history, I, I have been showing... Uh, they have some German bunkers over there on the beach. Oh, so man, it was I, really I know interesting. there's a lot of people that listen to me that'll be excited about that, man. So any other shout outs? Anything else you want to say, Bjorn? No, I, I just think uh, you have a very good show and uh, I think about you all the time and sometimes I copy you when I say um, uh, it's time for more beer and then I drink a beer and I, I burp in the camera. I did it the uh, last time I was streaming. It was really funny. <laughs> Hey, well, cheers, Bjorn, man. I, I I watch you too, and thank you for yeah, listening. Yeah, dude. Cheers to you, and hopefully, uh, you and Boucherine are having a pretty good uh, life together. I hope that's the case. Yeah, uh, I, I'm actually unemployed, and she's working, so uh, she's actually paying the rent at the moment. Oh man, look at Boucherine, so. man. All right, well, cheers to you guys, man. All right, good to talk to you. Yeah, good. Thank you very much. Uh, good. To Bye. Bye. All right, man. Go. Cheers to Bjorn, man. Right out of the Denmark prison after threatening the prime minister of Denmark. So, skull to, to fucking Bjorn. Let me have a drink. All right. Man, that was actually fun. It was good to hear from Bjorn. Uh, let's continue. I know people are fucking begging for Radio Graffiti to continue. Let's take a couple of numbers. How about uh, area code uh, 408, Radio Graffiti? Ghost, it's a globalist handler here. I just wanted to let you know there's one phrase you need to know about if you want to become a globalist, and it goes like this. Mm. You fucking piece of shit. Shut the fuck up. I'm getting tired of you people making fun of my humming exercises that helps me preserve my voice, dude. I Look, do you think I want to do that shit? Do you think I actually want to waste my time and look like a fucking idiot going... Mm. I mean, you think I really want to do that? I've got to do that to preserve my voice, dude. That's what I got to do. But you guys want to sit here and be like, Holly, I, look at you. I, I got my fucking uh, microwave oven. Do you hear this, Ghost? Mm. So anyway, people are saying to go on Power Chat. I don't know, man. I don't know. I, I, I don't know about that, dude. You know? Does it fucking bake Alaska and Nick Fuentes take a cut of power chat or some shit? I don't know about all that. Uh, how about uh, Kami for Wood Chippers, Radio Graffiti? Really suck at picking up calls. You hung up on my two names twice before Bjorn called up. Boomer versus technology strikes again. Anyways, let's expose the real truth about ghosts. Melting pot of friendship. How do you save a fucking from getting hit by a car? You don't. <laughs> Get this 
This is what you get with Oh no, I never said that! No! No! No, God! Look! Stop splicing me, making me say that shit. Stop using artificial intelligence and making it sound like I said some fucking bullshit that was racist when you know I don't do that shit. Fuck. Jesus Christ, man. All right, you know, this fucking radio graffiti is starting to fucking piss me the fuck off, dude. All right, I'm starting to get pissed off. How about, uh, who the hell is this? Kicking ass radio gra fucking graffiti. What the hell is that? I just got fucking beat up and shot by a bunch of fucking. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Jesus fucking Christ! Hold on, Raiden Snake, Radio Graffiti. Flower the Leafy on Radio Graffiti. I fucking hate the LGBTQ community. I'm not joking around. But if you're a homosexual or a lesbian or a bisexual or a tranny or any of that shit, you deserve to be repeatedly fucking hit in the balls with an acne brick. Do you understand me? If any of you people that are listening to me take it up the ass, suck a cock, or dive on the pearl tongue like a bull dyke, I hope you get monkey pox and your asshole rots out, you fucking stupid No, yeah, I no, said it. turn that no, off! No, 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 damn it, damn it, fucking god damn it. Oh, God, dude, y'all are fucking ruining my buzz, dude. Y'all you know, you, are fucking harsh in my mellow. Y'all are fucking not allowing the intoxicants that I'm consuming to settle in because you fucking guys are just, you guys are fucking just picking at me, picking at me, fucking rubbing it into my fucking face, like fucking, fucking, just fucking rubbing this shit in there. Fucking assholes. All right, what else do we got? You know, let me get some more scotch here, all right? I'm not fucking buzzing enough for this shit. All right, let's get some more fucking scotch going on. Jesus Christ. All right, all right. Let's go ahead and continue. Uh, how about, uh, how about, who the hell else we got? How about Capitalist Pepe, Radio radio Graffiti? Just fuck those apart. Fuck this shit, man. Fuck those man. Fuck all Fuck all Fuck all Fuck all this is not cool all right just get this out of here this is horrible all right this is why we have fucking people from the left that are coming at me thinking that I'm some racist Grand Dragon KKK or some shit. I'm a melting pot of friendship, and everybody should fucking know that by now, dude. Uh, how about, uh, who the hell is this? Uh, hit by a car, Radio Graffiti. Get this out of here! This is what you get with Get the Jesus fucking Christ. All right, dude, that's uh, that's enough, all right? If I continue to get these types of fucking bullshit, fucking AI, fucking splicing calls in this radio graffiti session, then I'm going to end the fucking shit and we're going to go back to fucking videos. Do you understand me? Huh? Do you understand me? <sighs> Give me a fucking drink. I'm going to drink some scotch here. <laughs> Uh, fucking 
good stuff, dude. Good stuff. All right, who else do we have? How about uh, how about area code? Uh, let's see. Let's take some numbers here. How about area code nine four zero radio graffiti? But the story of the game, as it so often is, was the Cowboys. Specifically, Mike McCarthy's team playing flag football again. The Cowboys' 2021 season ended with a playoff loss to the 49ers, a game in which the NFL's most penalized team was assessed 14 penalties. The total on Saturday night here in Denver, 17. Dude, a number shut of up. Teams Listen, no, shut your stupid, stinking, salmon-smelling hole. This is going to be our year this year, dude. All right? All right, Jerry Jones is lighting a fucking hot coal up these fucking pieces of shit's asses to make sure that at least, at the very least, we go to the division. At, at the very least. Just watch, all right? You fucking, you, you assholes talking all that garbage about the Cowboys. You just fucking watch, you piece of shit. How about 762 Radio Graffiti? Let me tell you something, Mark. Fucking ghost politics ain't going to come back. He's not going to come back for two reasons. One, he knows how you run the platform. And two, he's a fucking afraid of me. Ghost politics is a fucking afraid of me, man. I will destroy ghost politics, Mark, just like I would destroy you one-on-one. You want to come on here and talk with me, fucking Mark? What are you going to say about me? What are you going to say about me, Mark? What are you going to say about me, Mark? I'm a fucking loser streamer while I'm on your fucking right. platform, bitch. Just shut the fuck up and go take a shit in your goddamn styrofoam fucking icebox, you fucking piece of shit. All right? While you're living in your fucking rape van, you fucking meth head piece of crap. Fucking dumbass. Go fucking, uh, uh go be a caterer again, all right? You fucking idiot. Uh, how about, uh, who the hell is this? Rainbow Capitalist, Radio Graffiti. Melting, melting, Let's get to everybody's favorite part, and I'm talking about. Jesus Christ! Is that is that a fu- is that really some kind of fucking remix made out of me humming and shit? Are you fucking kidding me, man? Fuck it. And look at all these people in the chat room. They're like, ha oh, ha, oh, that's great, ghost. Ha 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 ha. Fuck it. Who, hold on. Who the hell is this? Trump Psyop Alert, Radio Graffiti. I'm going to save a fucking from getting hit by a car. You don't. Get him out, shit. Get him out. Look, if, I'm not fucking kidding. If I hear another goddamn call with an AI or a splice, I'm ending in fucking Radio Graffiti and I'm not fucking joking. Do you understand me? Do all of you fucking meat gazing, two girls in one cup loving, cheese hole chomping pieces of fucking testes tasting shit? Do you understand me? Jesus Christ, give me a drink here. Uh, I'm sorry y'all had to hear that shit, man. These people are fucking pissing me off. Uh, how about uh, who the hell is this? Spot the difference, radio graffiti. Do you such the liar? Anybody with access to past episodes in the many ghost show our kids can easily fact check you racist or spamming us. Also, you splicing excuses are one thing, but your real excuses are in the inoffensive low sin stack of trying to voices sound shitter than your real on your line. Yes? I am 100% positive that the video hasn't been altered in any way. Confirmed. Dude, shut up. Remove that shit! You see what I'm saying? You see, you see, you see what the fuck I'm talking about? Was that tarred ghost? Is that it? Was that was that my retarded clone version of me? We, you know, missing a few chromosomes and you know, it sounded like fucking Bill Clinton after uh, you know getting a couple of anal beads shoved up his shit funnel. You know? Oh, I don't know. You know, I don't know if you should put it in deeper, baby. I don't know. I'm just I'm not Bill Clinton here. You know? I mean, shit like that, dude. All right. How about uh, who the hell is Spats McGee? Radio Graffiti. 
sneakiest chameleon or J-Man radio graffiti. I'm tired of you people trying to make me sound like I'm anti-Trump. I am pro-Trump. I am ride or die with Trump. I would follow Trump into hell. Take that up. Take that up. We can no longer sit here and be loyal to Trump. Shut him up. Shut him up. Shut him up. Shut him up. Dude, that's it. All right, I'm done, dude. All right, that's y'all want to fuck with me, huh? Y'all want to fuck with me? No radio graffiti, you fucking assholes. Take it, take it out of here. Fuck this asshole. Fuck these pieces of shit. Goodbye. Yeah, goodbye. Goodbye is right. You fucking assholes. How fucking dare you, man? How fucking good, goddamn dare you, fucking piece of shit. Motherfuckers, dude. I, you guys are lucky you're not in a fucking bar room with me right now. I swear to God, I would turn your fucking face into fucking dog meat, you son of a bitch. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Man, as a matter of fact, you know what? I think everybody out there knows what time it is, all right? I think you all know what time it is. It's time for more beer! <laughs> While I'm getting bombarded by a bunch of fucking troll terrorists. Fucking assholes.